is how I make quick castellation holes. Castellation holes are uh, this row of uh, pads that basically looks like the top of our uh, castle. Uh, they used to uh, mount surface mount boards on another board. Uh, so sometimes you just need to, to make them uh, instead of... Uh, <clears throat> you can also order them for the fabrication house, but in case you forgot or do, you don't want to pay the extra cost, uh, it's possible to make them quickly using this tool and this tool, and I'll show quickly here. So you're trying to nibble away, uh, don't go all the way to the half, half circle, just go on the top of a circle and try to make your way. You'll see once you get started, it'll go pretty fast. Again, if uh, it depends how accurate you want to be, you can take it slowly, you can take it fast, but regardless, try not to cut away uh, into the circle just yet. Okay, so yeah, it took less than a minute. And again, this is, uh, <clears throat> this is a diamond plate. Uh, it has many grids. Uh, it helps to get to something like uh, 200. Uh, obviously, this is not <laughs> too expensive. It's around uh, 15 or 20 dollars, so it's uh, not big diamonds. But anyway, it, it makes the job really fast. Uh, it helps to have a one with these holes because they kind of tend to 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 take away more material. Anyway, so now just uh, do not apply a lot of pressure in the beginning. Just go slow. Okay. All right. So again, you might take it slow, depending on how how accurate you wanna be. You can take it slow, or you can go fast. Just make sure you apply even pressure. So you'll notice that if I apply more pressure here, I, I took away too too much material. So now I'll apply more pressure here. You're trying to get to to a semicircle to make sure this board, board is solderable. Again. All right. So continue filing until you get a result like this, uh, depending of, on uh, how fast you go. It might take two or three minutes. But anyways, hope this helps someone.